Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder of CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're going to be talking about uh, a question from someone in our community who's asking, will I ever find love? Now that's uh, a hard question for me to answer, but I can actually give you a question that you can answer that will make it easier for you to know whether you're going to find love or not. And so the question that you need to answer is, um, how smart are you going about dating and relationships? How, like, are you, are you being smart about it or are you being dumb about it? And, um, your chance of finding love is really low if what you've done up until now has hasn't worked out and you plan on continue continuing doing what you've done up until now so if you keep doing what you've always done you'll continue to always get what you've always gotten and so um, if you're just allowing chance and luck to determine whether or not you find love, um, you're going to have a really difficult time finding love if it hasn't happened already. Um, and, you know, the, the other way to use uh, to be dumb about dating and relationships is using bad dating advice. Um, a lot of dating and relationship advice out there is just horrible advice and and if you're spending a lot of time using bad dating advice and getting bad dating advice from people that don't know what they're talking about then uh, you have a really low chance of finding love however you have a high chance of finding love if um, you find out what isn't working in what you're doing and you stop doing what isn't working right that's step number one is find out what's not working and what you're doing and and stop doing it. And number two is getting around other people who have found love already. Um, you actually have a, a statistically, you have a much higher chance of falling in love and getting married and you know finding love and doing all that if the people around you have done it. And you have a much lower chance of finding love if the people around you have not done it already. Uh, so get around people that have. And the third thing that you need to do is you need to start reading and start learning smart dating and relationship advice techniques and tactics and strategies and um, use stuff that's smart, use stuff that works, use stuff that's helped other people get to where they want to be in regards to love. Um, finding love doesn't have to be based on luck or chance. Uh, you can take control of whether or not you find love in your life, but you have to take control. You can't just let it happen on its own. Um, you know, go out there and find information. Uh, so that's it for this video. If you want more information on how to attract a quality man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take my quiz. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.